self-mastery, conscious co-creation, accordion breathing technique. We are beginning to see clearly that Archangel Michael is giving us the tools we need to assist us in our ascension process in a step-by-step -step manner. These techniques can be used in a haphazard manner with minimal success. However, if we wish to make steady progress in our efforts to achieve self-mastery, we should learn these techniques in the order that they have been given. There is a reason for this, and it will become apparent as you master each technique and begin to see the positive results in your life. The accordion technique is the next level of breathing techniques Archangel Michael has given us. This technique should not be used until you have learned and practiced the following. Learn and use the step-by-step -step process of creating your personal paradise on earth by using the universal laws of manifestation. It is a very important that you build your personal pyramid of light in the fifth dimension so that you can slowly become acclimated to the lower fifth dimensional environment. Each time we enter any of our light pyramids in the fifth dimension, we bring down a little more of the fifth dimensional frequencies of light into our auric field and our Merkava vehicle of light. The fifth dimensional environment also prepares you to enter into a city of light and to begin the flow of adamantian particles into your personal pyramid and your physical body. This is accomplished by learning and performing regularly the infinity breath technique. By performing the binary sequencing technique at least once. By building your flower of life or creator wheel around you. This personal wheel of creation contains the qualities, virtues and attributes of God consciousness you will need as a co-creator of love, joy, harmony and abundance. Your personal allotment of activated adamantian particles will flow out into your personal creator wheel to be used in the material manifestation process. Having these guide particles readily available accelerates the process of manifesting that which you have envisioned via the universal laws of manifestation process and the living each day as a master technique. The co-creator process will not be beneficial if you have not taken all the above steps. However, it will not work as quickly or as efficiently. We must reach a certain level of balance and harmony within our four lower bodies, physical, mental, emotional, and etheric, in order to tap into the higher frequency levels of consciousness. It soon becomes apparent why there is a lot of groundwork to be done before this process will be of any tangible benefit to the average person. Archangel Michael has given us a gift beyond compare through his wisdom teachings. It is up to us to learn, integrate, and practice the teachings we accept as our truth. If we wish to successfully accomplish this evolutionary journey of ascension into a higher level of consciousness, which has been offered to humanity during these unprecedented times. First, draw forth a measure of adamantian particles via the infinity breath from your crystalline etheric replica, which resides on the crystal table in your personal fifth dimensional pyramid of light. This will start the flow of these divine particles of life light throughout your bodily vessel after they have been activated within your sacred heart via your loving attention. Before doing so, Michael has suggested that we state the following affirmation, which is our overall ultimate goal. I am a being of sacred fire. I am the purity of God's desire. I am a being of sacred fire. I am the perfection of God's design. The divine mind of God and I are one. I have named this latest breathing exercise the accordion breath technique because when it is done properly you will be drawing forth more adamantian particles from your personal pyramid down through your crown chakra into your sacred heart as you simultaneously draw up from the root chakra the kundalini or sacred fire energy that is stored there. The two streams of energy will mix within the solar power center and accelerate the process of clearing residual imbalance within the chakra system, which is an important step in attaining a higher state of consciousness. This melted energy will gradually flow up through each chakra, which results in the opening of the seven seals of higher consciousness within the physical vessel. Eventually, your chakra system will be perfectly aligned and will become a rod of power, a crystalline column of light from your crown chakra to the root chakra. This is the reason this process will not be of much benefit unless a person has done a considerable amount of spiritual cleansing work before incorporating the accordion breath to his or her rituals. 
First, blow the air out of your lungs. Place your hand on your waist as you focus on the solar plexus chakra. On the in-breath, pull in your tummy muscles as tight as possible and pause before the out-breath. You may want to blow the breath out a little forcefully through your mouth while you are becoming accustomed to the routine. In the beginning, as you begin, notice as you tighten the muscles at the waist. It also pulls up the muscles of the root chakra as you also draw forth the adamantian particles of creator light downward through your crown chakra. Second, pause for a moment after the in-breath. This is the still point. As you say the following affirmations, one with each breath. You may add your own. However, they are to be attributes, qualities, and virtues of God consciousness, not tangible things. You are focusing on becoming a conscious, proficient co-creator, whereby you will be able to create anything you desire that is in alignment with your personal divine mission and also the universal divine plan. I am divine love. I am divine abundance. I am divine harmony. I am love and action. I am God's creativity. I am God's power. I am God's radiance. I am God's serenity. I am divine gratitude. I am divine intelligence. I am divine faith. I am divine ecstasy. I am the beauty of God. I am God's will. I am God's inspiration. I am God's perfection. I am divine joy. I am divine truth. Now make up your own short affirmation using either I am God's fill in the blank or I am divine. Repeat each affirmation three times, one with each breath and in the beginning. Concentrate on only three or four of the affirmations during each breathing session. Later on, as the breathing techniques become habit, you can add more affirmations to a session or add new ones that come to mind. The vibrational patterns from each affirmation will automatically go out into your Creator Wheel of Life. Each of the twelve circles in the Wheel of Creation can hold a multitude of attributes, qualities, and virtues. As you surround yourself with this living light, you truly will be existing in a rarefied environment in which you are the Creator, and as long as you are seeking the greatest good for all, you can manifest anything you can envision. Another important benefit, as we draw forth the adamantian particles of Creator life light deep within our physical vessels, via the accordion breath technique, a portion of the transformational particles begin to flow throughout our bodily vessel. They will gradually penetrate our DNA, the cells, tissues, glands, organs, endocrine system, bloodstream, and every facet of our being, which will begin the process of healing, harmonizing, and returning us to good health, vitality, and youthfulness. Granted, it will not happen overnight, but as we practice these life extension techniques, we will begin to see a difference. Deep breathing is a critical component in maintaining good physical health and vitality. When we once again have access to the adamantian particles of life, deep breathing becomes the elixir of life and the key to a miraculous transformational process. End of lesson. <laughs>